Adam, how does leading a team of mortgage experts as a president at your company compare to leading a team of kids in a sport as a youth football coach? Well, I love the X's so no football. I love the planning that goes into that. Even at a level of, you know, eight and 10 year olds, I was told by my organization that my playbook was a little too complicated. <laughs> but I take that type of, I'm a natural coach at heart. I coached high school basketball. I played college basketball. So I take those lessons of coaching and I tell them all the time, I'm not your boss. <laughs> I'm not your president. I'm not, I am your coach. If you need a, a personal conversation and what I can help or offer on that side, on, on that front, I'm willing to do that. And those are, to me, the leaders I responded to. Mm -hmm. So I try and emulate the leaders that I responded well to as an athlete or as a young business, someone just getting out in business. And uh, there's all, so much similarities between running a company and being a coach. There's many books on it. I've read quite a few that, you know, it's right in line with how I think is what are your motivations? Each person's motivated differently. It's not always monetary. Sometimes it's, you know, it's emotionally. There are things that you learn about people as a leader. And then you, I'm constantly making adjustments, much like a coach. You're looking at what we did last month, or we're looking at what we did last quarter and who, who's it working for and who's it isn't working for and how, what processes can I modify slightly for somebody else? It's just not, it's not that process isn't working. And one of the big take takeaways as a leader from seminars or books that I've looked at is that a rigid coach or leader loses an audience. And so I am always open to change and conversations. I might still keep that process, but I might make a small modification. And that's kind of how I approach every day. I love coming here and talking to the team and working with them and new agents coming on board. I'm really excited as they get started and watch their education level grow. We take a lot of people new to the business and I, I love, love that opportunity to educate them and, and show them things that they haven't even thought of before. Why a mortgage works can work one way versus the traditional way that they thought. So coaching is, you know, anyone starting out who wanted to run a company one day or want coaching is such not only giving back to kids or community but you are you're learning so much about how information can be uh relayed misunderstood right? especially Absolutely. in football and, and those type of processes so it's it's just it was a natural it's a natural fit for me mm -hmm.